The U.S. Navy has advanced efforts to improve self-sufficiency for deployed ships and their crews, and has reduced supply chain lead times by leveraging additive manufacturing through the installation of the first metal 3D printer, permanently installed aboard a naval ship USS Baton. The equipment, installed under a joint effort between the commander, the Naval Surface Force Atlantic, and the Naval Sea Systems Command NAVSEA Technology Office, includes the Philips Additive Hybrid System, which integrates a Meltio 3D laser metal wire deposition head on a Haas TM-1 computer numerical control mill. The Haas TM-1 platform has been proven to operate reliably in an afloat environment aboard several aircraft carriers. Integrating the Meltio 3D deposition head with the Haas TM-1 provides both an additive and subtractive manufacturing capability within the same system, increasing efficiency and reducing waste when compared with typical machining. The Philips Additive Hybrid System prints 316L stainless steel, a prevalent material in U.S. Navy ship systems. While stainless steel additive manufacturing onboard naval ships is new, it also represents an advancement in providing sailors with industrial-level manufacturing capabilities to print individual parts for systems that previously have not been readily available without procuring the entire system at a significantly greater cost. The 3D printer works to maximize operational availability and reduces the demand on traditional and Navy-specific supply chains. Additionally, NAVSEA engineers installed a second 3D printer to produce polymer components onboard USS Baton. This printer enables the ship's crew to print any of the NAVSEA developed 300 plus AM technical data packages that define the required design configuration and procedures to manufacture a part and ensure it performs properly. NAVSEA subject matter experts and industry partners are working to test, evaluate, and field the most advanced AM technologies to improve readiness and increase capabilities, as demonstrated on USS Baton, a multi-purpose amphibious assault ship that carries more than 2,500 sailors and marines when fully embarked.